Uh, afternoon. <coughs> We've been on this a few hours. <laughs> thought I'd show you. A few people do ask to see your progresses and they're interested. So I thought I'd show you. I've cleaned up the glass. It took a good while. I've still got some specks of paint. Everything you go, you can go around it with like your fingernail. I always find paints on cabinets that have been in bedrooms and that. I've took the lock off. Uh, there it is. I've took the lock out. I have got some. You think I can find them? No, I can't find. Them. But I know I've got some top door locks to replace that. So I didn't have a key. Um, <clears throat> yeah, I think that one is going to. The couple of these lamps are out, and I've got no bulbs in. But well, that's not the end of the world. I reckon that's got a lamp there, which will go in that one. Um, the twenty p one has been a bit bodged. I mean, the switch is broke. It, you know, it's not the end of the world. Uh, obviously been messed about it a little bit. <clears throat> I think these have a general looming. Although this is an original machine, it is an original machine. It's all I'll show in a sec. But I reckon they. I mean, it's got like the three nudge buttons there. So I reckon they might use the same kind of cabinets and <clears throat> just put what they want in that cabinet because they put the buttons there. So that's okay. I mean, that's cleaned up really nicely. It was, it's been in a smoke smoke place place where they smoke. So, yeah, that's off the top glass, literally, that, that is what came off this top glass. So, compared to the first video, that's really, really bright, or it should look bright, I mean, there's still bits to clean, and I've could... got to go around it again, which I will. The bottom glass I've kind of <coughs> done. The two lamps work in it but they're flickery and you think i've got them here oh no of course not they're at home so i took the reels out to put new tube lamps in so i've cleaned them as well i don't know why i haven't cleaned the bottom it's going i've still got a lot to do on this machine um that's been bent round it's just mostly silly things right board wise this is what i really wanted to show you there's the um I mean, there's them, there's them boards in there. Hopefully, they'll be okay. Or just be 4099s. There's another little board there, which contains 4099s. Um, there's the ROM cartridge. Four ROMs. Uh, this one, <coughs> being a later machine, has the, uh, for those who know, people like, has the Navram chip, has the Navram board, which sits inside that cage, as you can see. As you can see, the back. it's actually not one of the worst I've seen. Normally, the whole board is chewed. I mean, the damage has just gone down there, down that track there, as you can see. But normally, it goes up that loom and onto the CPU side. But it, but it hasn't done that. That loom plugs in there. And normally, there's loads of green around there, and there's not. But it's not working. It's not working. It's um, I think there's a, a problem on this. Probably, it's either going to be... It'll either be these two, or it'll be that. That's generally the map, but I'm not too worried about that, because I've got a stack of boards there. And also, <coughs> I'll show you, I've got a bag full of these things, uh, bridge rectifiers. I've got a bag full of them. There's one in the cage. There, that's it there. And that's why it's just to change that. We've had a few go down. Well, John has. He's had a, he's, he's noticed a few of them have gone down. So it's probably wise just to change that as almost the service part. And on that side is your your switches and your lamps, basically. Mostly okay. A couple sometimes a couple of them go down, especially if they've been paying out loads. They you know they're fifty volts uh, switches sort of thing. And there's your four oh nine nines in a line there. <laughs> On the cage luckily for me and for all the others who've got these and all them ones over there these will run without this i was actually told they wouldn't at the beginning but because they needed that's the extra memory that's a ram trip and now it's called an avram but i find that they work okay and you, you obviously you don't have the memory so you don't really need that board i have there is some made a mate of mine has made some of these so i could actually put one in if i can find them some of them have got them, a couple of them haven't. But I find the machines run okay. So the extra ram there, you don't really... But I just thought I'd show you. So for anyone who finds these later black boxes, 
definitely get the cage off because this is definitely going to be, you know, not good. Okay on that board, but as soon as that rot starts going up that loom and onto your main board. <coughs> so, there you go. Hopefully, so I've got, I, I think there'll be a fault on here. So for quickness, I'll probably just put a number. I've got a, oh, here's one I made earlier. It's like Blue Peter here, isn't it? <laughs> I think that's a working black box as well, although it's got the earlier. It's, it's, oh, look, see, that one's had battery, where the battery loom has gone up. You can see the green on there, that's had it. But that's the, um, I think that's the earlier CPU side, because if you, I'll show you the difference. Yeah, if you look at them side by side, that one's got extra microchips down there. I think that's mainly for the data collection port, which is that little brown plug, which basically collects data from the front. So there you go. As you can see, there is a difference. For those interested, or those who don't give a shit, I don't know. Anyway, I just thought I'd show you a few bits of what. So I've been, I've spent a good few hours on this. I've had, I had the first thing I had to do was put a new lead on it because when they got it down the stairs, they broke the plug and the, the lead was short anyway. So I thought I'd take the opportunity to put a longer lead on. So I took the power supply out. I checked all the fuses and one was blown. So that was so that was a worthwhile exercise. So that's back in the power supply is back in. I'm getting all lights on the on the board. I get all the uh, three LEDs on the board. Oh, there's the data collection that thing there. So. <laughs> But it's not working but there you go anyway oh and it is an original machine there you go so see you in a bit have fun